<laughs> I like how you're dressed today. Oh, yeah. You look pretty cool. I like your hair actually, like that kind of like unbrushed and. It looks kind of like yeah, it looks awesome. Okay. Kind of like grungy. It's like a little business, business grunge. Well, that. <laughs> So I've been on Waker and then Caleb actually started me. All the way from the beginning? Yes! Oh no! And I thought you were going to be mad at him. You want me to go get him? Yes! Do I look like a pastor than You do look like a pastor baby. You look more like a pastor than I ever did. <laughs> You're like so handsome. <laughs> I want you to be a pastor. You want me to be a pastor again? Do you know what that would mean? Mm -hmm. It'd mean me leaving for church at like 7 a.m. every Sunday instead of going with you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but why do you like me being a pastor? Because you teach. Because I teach? Yes. The whole church? <laughs> I miss that. You know that? I really miss that a lot. That's why I want you to be a pastor. You're cute that you care for me and want me to do the things I love. I love you. You got a good heart. You're always thinking about other people. Okay. Ready to go to church, everybody? No Bibles. leaving Bibles at churches, okay? Okay. I don't know why I said churches. So we went to church today and now we're after church and we're getting chilies for lunch. Kids fell asleep in the back of the truck. The truck actually needs the AC to be recharged, so it's not very cool. It's pretty hot. Or an air conditioner. Yeah, it needs an air conditioner charge. So you have your normal burgers, which are already like high in calories, and then you have what, Melanie? The boss. The boss. <laughs> Over 2,100 calories. Oh, great. I didn't want to have any other meals today. Right. <laughs> Do you know where my grams are? I you you want to share the boss? I don't think I can eat it alone. No, I don't want the boss. Timmy, you want to share the boss with me? I don't think I can eat it alone. No? Oh, they did the way? No, the boss. Look at the boss. You want to share the boss with me? What? Dad? Yeah, that. Can you like the second in command? You want to share it with me? You can be the junior boss. Oh my gosh. Didn't think so. That has the fewest calories. It's 1,300 calories. Yeah, that ain't good, man. What in the world is going on with these burgers? I remember asking the nurse, what are you doing? I remember asking the nurse, am I in active labor or is this like, just like, is this gonna get, how much harder is this gonna be? Because I was in a lot of pain. She was like, no, you're good. It's about, you're about where you need to be. It's not, the pain's not gonna get any worse, but it's just gonna get like more frequent until you until you come. So by the time that I got there, to the time that I got in your room, you were already here. What a noise to choose. <laughs> <laughs> and that's how you were born. That's the miracle of how Caleb came into the world. In Ni the house. Nine years ago today. Wait, in our No, house? at a hospital. What are you talking about? I thought No, at I might just see my room. It's a hospital room. They took her to her room at the hospital. So like, they changed our house into a hospital? No, Caleb. Then they, why'd you say to her room? Her like, room it's like when you go to a hotel. There's a room that you stay in at the hotel. It's your room for as long as you're there. Okay. It's a room at the hospital, and as long as you're there, that's your room, okay? Got it? Someday we'll tell you more, but that's, an, that's it for a nine-year-old. That's all you need to know. Hey. Hey. Tell me nine stories. Tell, I'm nine. Tell you nine stories? How about I spank you nine times? That's the tradition. Can we do the Waker song? Maybe. Oh, that's pretty. Turn it this way. That's pretty. Good job. I like it. <laughs> this is water slide. It's a water slide? Yeah. Oh, kind of like at the party? Yeah. That's pretty cool. And, it, it's, and this is little pool and that's umbrella. Oh, that's awesome. And who's that down there? Sparky. Sparky, I knew it. 
<laughs> I knew it. That's pretty. Good Why job. don't we play on the one side? Spock always jumps in there. Oh, I know. He loves it, doesn't he? Yeah. What do you got there? I have a pool. A pool? Yeah. I, I love it. You did such a great job. I have water slide. A water slide? Yeah, and water. Yeah, with water. Yeah. Uh huh. Caleb, what do you got there? Forsaken Fortress. That's a level from Wind Waker, right? Yeah. Forsaken Fortress, and that's actually pretty accurate. Man, look at the lights and the tower, and then that big bird, right? And the shipwreck and the ocean. Good job. So we, I actually can't talk very loud. We are in Katie's room, and it's a super secret. The boys don't know we're in here. I think Caleb's downstairs. I think he's ready. He's reading, and then the other two are asleep? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. They're in their room. They're being quiet. So they're either getting in trouble or they're falling asleep. And we are um, doing a little something new, something we've never done before. We had a bunch of our viewers telling us about a another Indian holiday they thought we should celebrate. Uh, we celebrated Holi back in March. Holi is a... It's a very, a very cultural holiday, even if people are Hindu and they celebrate it as Hindus, people from many different religions in India celebrate Holi, so it's become more of like a, a, a cultural thing, is our understanding. Many people kept commenting and telling us about this holiday. It's called, I hope I say it right, Raksha Bandhan? Raksha Bandhan? Sounds Raksha. Right. Does that sound right? I don't know. Oh, she, she did. So Katie doesn't know this one. She knew about Holi because she told us how, uh, for Holi, what did you do at the orphanage? Um, like some kind of bucket and they put the water, color, colors water, yeah. and we take it and we play with it, like spray everyone. Spray everyone with it? So she remembered Holi, but I kept trying to tell her about this one and she was like, no, that one doesn't sound familiar and that kind of makes sense if you know what the holiday's about. So Raksa Bandhan, it sounds more like a, a religious holiday. So even though we are not Hindu, we're not Jain or anything like that, and by the way, we don't know exactly which religions celebrate it. I've read Hindu, I've read Jain, so if that is a an insult to anyone, I hope I'm not saying it wrong. I never want to insult people. But anyways, I did a little bit of research, enough to be dangerous, and uh, found out that even though it's a religious holiday and we're Christians, so we're not celebrating it from a religious perspective, we do love one of the things that the holiday honors, which is the relationship between a brother and a sister. And we've never done anything special like that. And Katie, you know, she's participated in birthdays since coming home, but we've, we really don't have any holidays in America that that right i mean that really focus on the relationship between a brother and a sister so we thought it was really cool we looked it up and we found out that one of the things this holiday entails is making little bracelets for your brothers so that's what we're doing we're super secret we got her door shut we're all in her room and actually mommy and katie are going to do this i need to get back to work unfortunately i can't be involved in this but mommy and katie are um, gonna make little bracelets for caleb and Thank Logan you. and Timmy, yeah. Mm -hmm. We went to, to Hobby Lobby and we did something just like like a, a like a, a kit, right? You would call mm -hmm. it like a a bracelet. a bracelet kit. And it's not super Indian, obviously, but it's what we could get our hands on today. So Katie, you're going to pick colors for each brother. We probably want to do like combinations, right? Mm -hmm. Don't you think? Like you could pick like these two colors for Logan, these two for Timmy these two for Caleb or something like that. But keep, stay on this side. Yeah, those are their favorite colors, actually. I don't think any of them... You could do the ones that are, like, in between. One of the boys has said before that he likes pink. Was it Logan? Yeah, it was Caleb. Oh, was it Caleb? You're right, it was. Caleb. Look, these are, like, Caleb the ones that have mixed. Pink. Some of them so are mixed. So, what colors do you want for... Let's start with Timmy. Which colors do you want um, for Derek? I'll give Timmy, like, this yellow. So, and yellow Do you want and... any, any other colors? Um... Yeah. What? Um, yellow and blue. Yellow and blue for Tim? That's mm -hmm. cute. That's the colors of my high school. Don't like that kind of color. You know what? The middle. You can put like one of those on each boy's. Like as a center, as a center stone one, mm -hmm. or something like that. Yeah, time to time lapse this. Yeah, I'll see you later. <laughs> That was a trial and error kind of thing. I think we lost 
bracelets, what, four or five times probably? We had to start over again. Um, but this string was much better than the last six strings. So these are, whose is this one? Logan's and Timmy's and Caleb's. And Caleb's. So we're going to be doing that after nap time. So time for you to head to bed. Good job, Katie. The kids woke up from nap time. Katie's got the bracelets for the boys. Everyone just came downstairs. Oh, hide them. And here they come. Here they come. Okay, hide them behind her back. Okay, nice and close. Nice Daddy. and close. No peeking. There's nothing. It's. <laughs> what, what do you mean? Nothing? There's nothing to see, you mean? Okay, okay, okay. Nothing. Nothing, nothing. It's just. Yeah. I was just looking it's just, at cups. <laughs> You're just looking. Oh, I'm just looking at dad's cups. I'm just looking at dad's cups. <laughs> Don't open. Katie got you something special. She made it. She made it for you. I, open! I opened it. <laughs> I know what these are. <laughs> the moment it hits your hand, I you knew. Oh, oh, that's so sweet. It? There you go. Put so them over your hand. Oh, oh. Aww. Well, I Do you love it? Yeah. Yeah, say thank you, Katie. You know why she made those? One of the reasons is because she loves you very much. Do you love your brothers? Yeah, I do. Yeah, oh yeah, I do. <laughs> and another reason is because it, it kind of symbolizes how you, as her brothers, it's your job to protect her. Like you're one of the people who will always look after her in her life, right? You always sworn to serve and protect Cadence. Are you always gonna take care of your, your, your sister and look out for her? Yeah. Are you? Yeah. Always gonna take care of your sister and look out for her? Yeah. I know you guys are. Caleb's probably the most protective, though he won't admit it. Yeah, you're the least of all likely to admit that you are protective over your sister, but you look out for her more than anyone. Even if daddy is playing around with Katie, like pretending to be like mean to her or something, he'll do, he'll, Caleb will be like, dad, that's not funny. That's not cool. Like, he's the biggest protector of Katie, aren't you? I guess I am. You are. You really are. It's natural for you. Shout out to Cassandra Lane, who found the hidden zoo animal in our last video and tagged it in her answer to the question of the day. We asked, what is the most memorable birthday you've ever had? Cassandra remembered a birthday from when she was eight or nine. There was such a bad snowstorm that they had to actually cancel the party. But they had already ordered the pizza for the party and they were left with a week's worth of pizza for their family. Cassandra says that a week's worth of pizza was honestly the best thing an eight-year-old could ask for. That is an amazing story. Thanks to everyone who participates in the hidden zoo animal challenge. Don't forget to tag the hidden zoo animal from this video in your answer to the question of the day and we may give you a shout out in our next video. See you tomorrow, everybody.